I make the best schmoes in all of town of Paul. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Mm. Mm. Want to buy my s'more? Mm. No. You gotta eat your s'more. Mm. You just don't want to finish eating it. Mm. Do we get lightning bugs here? No, fortunately not. I've never seen a lightning mm. bug out here. I wish. Mm. Got some drip action. And we call them fireflies because we're Yankees. That's what Yankees say is fireflies. What I say? <laughs> lightning bugs, like a southerner. I was called lightning bugs. Oh, wow. That's a very <laughs> southerner in turn. We are enjoying our drunken footage from last night. I will not post those online for you. But it was a good time. <laughs> and we're having coffee and contemplation mm -hmm. in our soon-to-be living room. Hi guys, so what you saw me and Adrian doing earlier this morning is we were unloading the trailer. We managed to get our hands on 75 sheets of 4x8 half inch thick plywood. So here is our my lovely stack of plywood. I'm very excited to show that to you guys. And if you see on here, it is dated back in from 2013 so we have a neighbor here luckily um who actually is the fellow that sold us this property he's our next door neighbor and he said any way i can help you guys out uh you know i see you guys building your tiny home i know what you're doing for your family and so he gave us uh, well he didn't give this to us but what he did is he sold us all 75 sheets of this plywood half off the cost of plywood today. So in 2021, these sheets of plywood, they run for $50 basically a piece, a sheet. And so that would have ran us, I think I was doing the math, that would have ran us about $3,750 if we had to go to Home Depot and buy all of this. Um, with that being said, our neighbor gave it to us half off. And so we paid one thousand seven hundred and fifty dollars for all sheets so it was a win-win for him because he bought this back in 2013 when these were probably like ten dollars a piece and it was a win-win for us because we got all of this plywood for half off so that was very exciting yay <laughs>
Hi guys, so the video you saw me and Adrian working on yesterday is we were hanging our ceiling joists in the main part of our house. Uh, we lost daylight, so I actually couldn't get a video of what we did out there. Um, but it we ended up doing the ceiling joists for the whole main part of the house. So for the living room, the kitchen, and for mine and Adrian's bedroom. We still have to do the ceiling joists in the kids' rooms and the bathroom. Um, the ceiling joists that we hung were 16 foot two by sixes. So that's what we ended up, my arms are sore this morning because that's what we, me and him together, uh, were lifting those uh, 16 footers up there and just tacking them in. So we did a, we did a lot of work yesterday together. While I'm here, I just wanted to show you the uh, platform that I'm using to create my video content on. Um, so I have uh, an iMac and already pre-installed down here comes, it comes with iMovie. Um, this is a really great uh, place to create movies, to edit and put them on YouTube. So th this is where I will be, this is where I do all my behind the scenes work right here at my iMac. And I will start updating you guys weekly. Um, I'm hoping to get up a video once a week. Uh, right now, it's I, my goal is to get about 30 minutes of footage per week, um, but it's really hard to get actually that much footage with all the time lapses that I do. So I take hours and hours and hours of footage and somehow I'm only ending up with 15 minute videos. So um, today's, this week's video is gonna be really short because I was having issues with my charging and my GoPro out there on the property. Me and Adrian, we camped for two weeks or two days, I'm sorry. Um, so we uh, left early this morning at four in the morning before I could take a video of the ceiling joist that I really wanted to show you guys. So that was just a little time lapse of me and Adrian starting on the ceiling joist. And like I said, I was having issues with charging. So we did end up getting all of those joists up. Um, and that was uh, a lot of fun. It was a lot of work. And we're working the property from sun up to sundown when we can. So it's it's been a really good time. So thanks for following. Uh, like and subscribe to our channel, Renaissance Farms AZ, uh, and keep keep track of what we got going on out here in the desert. Eventually, you know, once the house is built, we'll have footage of, you know, our animals that we want to eventually own, chickens, and how we're going to collect water and what we can do since um, that's like the number one is water. So, but anyways, I'm talking a lot. Um, I will... Keep you guys updated. Have a great day. We love you. Bye.